People living on Milwaukee's east side are frustrated at a spike in car break ins. One person witnessed his own car window smashed early this morning. Brennan Hebner sent us this email asking us to look into it. So our Marion McCard did. She heard from Brennan and other victims on the east side. We've been seeing a number of Facebook posts about a rash of car break ins on the east side. So we decided to come down and see for ourselves in just one intersection. You can see this truck's window is smashed a few feet away. This Jeep's window was broken into and a corner away from that. A third car vandalized overnight. Not far down Marshall Street, piles of glass on the ground show parking spaces where other cars were hit early Wednesday morning. And it's not the only street on the east side that was targeted. Last night, like 3.30 in the morning, I woke up, went to get some water and heard some smashing. Brennan Hebner lives less than a mile away on Cass Street and saw a group of people breaking into his and his girlfriend's car. They smashed at least, I think it was eight cars. He reported the incident to police before emailing us about what happened. You said this isn't the first time it's happening. Nope, third time now. How frustrating is it for you, not only that this has happened, but now this is the third time it's happened? It makes me not want to be in the city. It's a harsh reality that Hebner's neighbor, Mauricio Roa, is all too familiar with. Just last Saturday, I was just uh, sleeping at 6 in the morning. I listened to like a big noise, and I went outside. And sure enough, my car windows were busted. For Roa, the spike in crime makes it hard to feel safe in the area. You feel kind of unprotected because you don't know where to park right now. Both Roa and Hebner hope more police patrols will be sent to their area and in the meantime, encourage others to be cautious when parking on the street. On Milwaukee's east side, Miriam McCart, TMJ4 News.